I walked in on the ghost of my father, who is dead. He was drinking with the ghost of my son, who is still alive. The third man at the table looked up at me, and I was looking at a ghost of myself. My father got up from the table, turned and left by the screen door. I took the chair he'd vacated and looked at the other two. My son was speaking to the ghost of me, words I couldn't make out. I was suddenly struck by a question. I said, which one of us is a ghost? I looked out through the window. My father was walking away from the house. He had gotten to the far end of the field and with his back to me, he just kept on walking. My son tapped me on the hand. I turned back to look at him and he seemed to be looking straight at me, but he was looking through someone else's eyes. Then he raised up his glass of whiskey and poured it over his head and struck a wooden match on the tabletop and lit himself on fire. As I looked at my son who was burning, my ghost who was sitting next to me remained silent with lowered gaze and I realized he was formed from solid ice. And then another thought occurred to me that there might be a song in all of this and I turned to tell the old man but by now he was halfway across the valley. I snapped a few fingers off my own ghost, put them in a glass, held it over my burning sun until the fingers melted, then upended the glass and doused the flames. My son and I are deep in conversation now. My ghost has melted and my son has quit smoldering. But I keep glancing back to check the old man's progress. The farther away he gets, the clearer I can see him.